Hello and welcome to the Grand Line Review, your source for everything One Piece, with the exception of this very day, because a mighty number has been achieved. This channel now has 15,000 subscribers, and as a result, we are going to do that thing that we do, where we celebrate by highlighting some of your best channel comments. Enjoy! This time we are going to commence with a prediction from Bobby Ecker. I have to say the name that way because it has an exclamation mark. While I watch this, I predict I will not be here and probably won't be there for best channel comments 15. Well, you were pretty damn wrong. Take that, Bobby Ecker. Next up is a request from a user who was rather eloquently named Fuck. Explain my dick. And well, Mr. Fuck, I would, but I'm afraid that all subject matter for my 101 videos have to be at least four and a half minutes long. And your dick, well, you of all people should know that it doesn't quite get there. And now, Uni Black Sister would like to try and bribe their way into this special. I'll give you a cookie if you put me in the next one. And well, I've held up my end of the bargain. I'll be expecting that cookie soon, yeah? But while I wait for said cookie, let's examine a very simple statement from Just Stuff 23. Chopper Luffy. Although Just Stuff 23 doesn't believe this adequately got his point across. So he typed it again and again and about a billion more times until he was satisfied that his message was conveyed. So Just Stuff 23, if I understand this correctly, you believe that Luffy is greater than Chopper, yeah? Glad I could help deliver that message. Now we move to a comment on a recent video I did featuring the top five artists in One Piece. One of the lucky recipients of a spot on that list was Kanjiro, despite his rather pathetic technical drawing ability. But that didn't bother me so much, nor did it seem to worry OOTW Publishing and Media. Bet Kanjiro can draw me a better man, which is either a great compliment to Kanjiro or a third degree burn to your current man. Either way, yay for Kanjiro. So recently I also did a One Piece 101 on Marguerite, which prompted an interesting response from someone whose name is entirely incomprehensible to my pathetic English speaking tongue. I hate the woman island, but I don't mind some of the visuals. And you know, I think I know what you're talking about. The architecture of Amazon Lily is simply stunning. I don't mind those visuals at all. However, Daddy Esterosa does mind something and that something is me. Your voice is so annoying. I just want to punch the shit out of your pretentious cracker face, lol. And listen here, you. You leave my pretentious cracker face alone, all right? In fact, I think Ryan Bassas has a retort for you. Fool! Yeah, you, you tell him, Ryan. And you know what? Zanser also wants to give you a piece of his mind. I like cherry pie. That was much less effective, but I guess I appreciate the support, Zanser. And now it's time for the three unrelated, but for some reason put next to each other images of the week, featuring special guest Kadir Hill. This week, we have the following three pictures. Kadir, can you make any sense of these images whatsoever? Damn well sex. Very good, Kadir. Who's a clever boy? Not you, because you misspelt the word damn. Just get out of my sight. All right, now it's business time. Last week, you were all asked a very irrelevant, I mean important question by James Cataldo, and that was, if there are devil fruits, are there devil vegetables? And well, we have our answers. First up, Jim Dramatic enthusiastically cast his vote for the affirmative. There are indeed devil vegetables. They give you such amazing powers, such as the Brocky Brocky no Mi, which gives you excellent vitamin C and K. The PP no Mi allows yourself to turn into multiple peas to shoot your enemies. And the Tato Tato no Mi, which allows your body to be mashed, boiled, Frenched and fried, thus becoming a delicious snack for all. Hope that answers things, and it certainly does, but as a broccoli lover, I'm keen for some more details on that particular devil vegetable, and perhaps Ali Al Marus can help. I ate a devil vegetable. It's shaped like a broccoli. A square, there's a square there for some reason. Well, I haven't found out what power I got, but it did taste bad like any other devil vegetable. By the way, you can swim, but you cannot fly once you eat one. And you know, I suppose that makes sense. You'd more than likely be stopped at customs for bringing in foreign vegetable produce when attempting to fly. But you know, devil fruits and vegetables are only the tip of the iceberg for Link Tchik. There are not only devil fruits and devil vegetables, but devil carbohydrates, devil dairy, and devil protein. This creates the devil food pyramid. Sadly, there are no signs of the existence of devil sweets. And while the idea of a devil food pyramid does intrigue me, there can only be one right answer, and it appears to come from Rui Rui. No, there are only angel vegetables. Get it rigged, you fool. And geez, my apologies. As it turns out, there are no devil vegetables, only angel vegetables. So I'm glad we can all now get that rigged. So with that, we're going to close the book on this question and pose our next curious inquiry, which this time comes directly from the Grand Line Review Discord server from a user by the name of God Usopp. If Uso equals lie, 
Does that mean I'm a lie? God is up essentially asking all of you if his existence is a lie. But that pretty much does it for this edition of the best channel comments. If you enjoyed this video, then feel free to like, favorite, or subscribe. And if you are in any way keen on supporting this independent channel, then please feel free to check out my Patreon, Discord server, or Twitter, the links to which are in the handy description below. This has been the Grand Line Review, and I'll see you next time.